I'm getting set up. What I'm posting now on the uh, chat will be the link to my novel if you want to check it out. Um, for y'all on YouTube watching this later, I will post the link into the descriptor. See someone run by screen, or was that what the NPC? Ocean. I, I didn't hit that. Friggin' bone. Sorry, I'm just posting notifications, natural writer areas. There we go. And now, last but not least, I will copy down this link so I can repost it all the time. I, I know that that's the Elf Sweeper do this one I'm hearing. Okay, welcome to Elder Scrolls Online again. I wasn't originally going to do blah, 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 Fortnite, but I kind of really wanted to come back on here and play some more uh, werewolf things. So here's how this is going. And I went ahead and post one down in the chat so we'll know. So here's how this is going to go. Um, yeah, that doesn't show up on screen. I'm going to... I have uh, a chunk of the 50 I had left. I didn't send out that many from the earlier stream. So I have a chunk, and they go out tomorrow, which means tonight will be the last time you get it. Um, if you don't get it tonight, they're just going to expire. So, you know, I have a chunk left. If you want this chunk... Uh, and you're here on stream, ask me for them, and I'll post them down in the uh, chat below. Now, each time I post one, you'll have to go directly to grabbing it on the Google Play Store. This is for only for Google Play to kind of support my Google Play release, which was uh, eight, nine days later than the original release. It's freaking the 11, 12, so... Eight days left. So yeah, we uh, with eight days after its original release, Google Play is a little late. So to support the Google Play release, I am giving away the book for free. If you come over here and grab it, if you want it, just tell me in the chat you want it. I will get you a code. Um, in fact, not only will I get you the code. I will go over here. No. Okay. 
Just get out of the edge. Get out of the edge and go over here. There. And the code will have to redeem from uh, Google Play Redeem area. Um, go to their place, go to the redeem codes, put in the code, and it should bring you to my book. And you should get it for free. I have a chunk left. Completely free instead of $5. If you want to support me instead, or if you're over there on YouTube and you won't be able to actually join in on this because you're on YouTube, click on the link either in chat or over in the YouTube descriptor, or if you're in VOD's the VOD descriptor, and buy the book for $5 instead of handing me uh, instead of handing me instead of handing me money for nothing for being on here and playing, buy the book for $5. You have a thousand word book Five bucks, and you still save my skin by uh, pain. Too many. I can't take it. Oh, I should do some damage there. I don't have a bear. I don't have a bear. Okay, so we are looking for the Watchman, who is now back this way. See the guy who ran past us? Fine. <laughs> you might want to get back on your boat, Seafarer. The dead are crawling from the sea, and they have overtaken the docks. There is nothing to be done. We just have to pray to Tuwaka that they wander away. Why aren't you fighting the zombies? Zombies? Oh, such a crude term. These Ramnetu are the remains of sailors who shipwrecked off the coast. We respect our dead here in the Alakir Desert. Even those who died at sea are honored ancestors. We do not fight them. We would be cursed. I'm pretty sure them rising from the dead is a curse. And who would I be cursed for fighting them? No. You are an outsider. These are not your ancestors. And as such, there is no dishonor in striking them down. No curse. Oh, but the fact that the dead have risen at all. It is terrible. We have strict laws. This should not happen here. So how did it happen? I do not know. And I fear we have only made the situation worse. We thought we could contain them. We built barricades and tried to herd them away, but it was to no avail. Now, I fear, we are in even greater danger. What can I do to help? My fellow guards will not strike the Ranatu either. Jasmine, Pierjean, and Emidal. I fear for their lives. Please find them and send them away. Then meet at the warehouse. The Dark Master hides there, and he may know the cause of all this. All right, I'll help other guards and then meet you at the warehouse. Just Please, me. no, go away. They're going to find me. I'm covered I in their undead die. blood. Get out. No, none of us are. The Ranitu are going to kill us all. It is not fair. I am too young to die. I just want to run, to run away. Then get out. They're dead again. Does she run? I didn't see her pass me up. Okay, so we have two more to clear. Ah. 
halfway of my werewolf. Worm. Wait, what's the thing you Mercy, what have I done? I was just trying to defend myself, and now I have committed the greatest dishonor and brought a curse down upon my family. Now, before you start going after them on the curses and on things, remember, in this world, the gods aren't only real, they've shown up before, especially the Daedra. So curses due to striking down the dead or harming the dead or destroying the dead, whatever the hell curses, might be real. Might. Kind of iffy. What happened? This Ronetu caught me. He was trying to bite me, to eat me. I tried to fend him off, but he jerked, and his head ran against my blade. It wasn't my fault. What am I going to do now? I suggest you leave, start by leaving this area. But what about stopping this Ronetu from getting into the city? What about the other guards? I cannot simply abandon them. Can I? I'll take care of those things. You go. Practice of cutting off hands of hanging my ears. Pretty live in the whale. Sold a merchant for gold. Okay. on me, please. I'm not into that. Great Rutka, if this be not your will, send me a sign. Wait. Who are you? What are you doing here? I am here to help you. Blood and honor. I have always had faith, but never have I. You are here to fight the Ronetu? Praise Rutka. I was prepared to dishonor myself, but he sent you. I will go then. Gods be with you, my friend. Is the way clear? As clear as it's going to be. We're through spawning. Bad guys go on. Did I get past that earlier? I can't get past again? I be werewolf yet. Yay! This human do. I don't know if being out in this form out here is going to disturb anything, but we're going to try.
everybody's got larva. There we go. Oh, we can undo it. Ah, I was unaware we could actually turn it off. So does that set it back to normal? Yeah, that is set it back to normal. I didn't even know y'all were here, what the hell. I should've just came in my werewolf form. Excuse you, do you have a path? You're supposed to stay on, and I was well outside your path. It appears to be struck down by unholy magic. Yeah, I'm sure it has something to do with these skeleton people. Anybody up here? I see a giant murderer. Finally, someone who's not afraid to do the dirty work. Someone to clean up my docks. I watched you from the window until I heard those necromancers downstairs. But I thought Mujad was coming here too. Did you see him? Mujad is dead. Damn. Poor bastard. I told them. I told the guards that they were going to have to fight back. It is one thing to be superstitious. But when the Ranetu are attacking the city, it's time to put the superstitions aside. You don't believe as they do. No, we're not all so hung up on our beliefs. Can't ignore the tradition, though. Not unless we want fruit thrown at us, or worse. Regardless, right now I'm just glad Taba's winds guided you here. Someone to get the Ranetu off the damn docks. If I will, if I can. Do you know a way? I do. Not the way. I overheard the necromancers. Their leader is calling the dead from the sea with some kind of dark ritual. If you can disrupt the ritual, the dead should... Well, they should drop dead. Or at least stop crawling out of the water. Where are they conducting this ritual? That I do not know. I heard them mention the warehouse at the west end of the docks. Maybe the ritual is there. Wherever it is, you have to stop it. Then tell Captain Safira. Tava be with you. Okay. Well, I'm never canceling my werewolfism again because holy cow, I could have killed them too and eaten them. You probably would have been fine. What do you have again? Oh, sword. Oh, I have an orc cauldron I picked up. Sure, right? <laughs> This isn't orc, it's Nord, but it's light and upgraded. 200 in armor, everything going up by a handful of numbers, so... Yeah, why not? I have to recolor it. I just colored these guys. <laughs> oh, I'll pick that up and see how it is. That way. Not too bad, they are damaging me a little. That one they can dip. Could do a saver spot for that. Almost. Let's back up there. 
percent and send the sleep every time the werewolf could be some help. This is a semi safe area before we go. Inventory. We're going to see if my second one or first one's the weakest. 11, 20. 11. Oh. Two handed, two handed. So 1178, 164. 90. Please sound like that. 28, 11. Not good. Damage takes down physical penetration, though. Damage up by four hundred. Penetration goes down by four thousand. Um, nah, don't either. Of these these guys suck. We're not trading off that much. I don't trade off that much. My father first used this spell to call the dead from the sea 20 years ago. Today we perform this again in his honor. There are shipwrecks along the beach just west of the docks. Conduct the ritual there and be glorious. He must alive. I didn't read who that was from. Oh, I was just going to devour. I guess not. <laughs> Oh wait, is that not the ritual? Oh, I wasted my time eating that necromancer. I wasted my. Is that an animal or a statue? Okay. Oh, I didn't need to hit that. That's fine. That's what I meant to do. Talk to the watch, Captain. Yeah, it's bright. <laughs> the teeter runs funny. Well, me. I mean, well, I'm a wolf. I don't know if I met you yet. The raw net you have returned to the sea. The docks will soon smell of dead fish again instead of dead people. 
And you, ride off the boat, and you slay the necromancer? Surely Tuwaka sent you to deliver us from this difficult situation. I was glad to help. I am too. It has been many years since the plague of necromancy visited our shores. Though I am relieved the docks are clear, the events of this day are extremely disturbing. I wonder if you know how completely we are in your debt. Alakir warriors fear no evil, but they will not fight the undead. It may be a superstition, but it has been tradition for centuries. I would not have convinced my guards to break it today. Surely we were fighting some kind of response? I'm afraid not. It was just no easy solution. Perhaps to call everyone inside the castle and lock the doors? King Faharajad would not have liked that. Of course, the king will be extremely disturbed to hear what has befallen her regardless. The king doesn't know. I did not want to send word to the king until I was certain necromancy was involved. Now, though, he should be informed right away. I must stay here and oversee the cleanup. You are the one who turned the tide here. Will you inform the king as well? Sure, I feel like I've heard his name dozens of times. But he sh he showed up in the it's north, right? I remain here to supervise as best I can. Up in the north but for I him. know the king would want to be informed. I know his what has daughter is married to the high king, but like, I think he was involved somehow earlier, or someone representing him was involved in something. Can you explain your people's beliefs about the dead? The dead are sacred. It is what the people of Alakir have always believed and always will. Just as we respect our elders, so do we respect our ancestors. It would be dishonorable to strike them, and might even cause one to be cursed. Haven't necromancers threatened Alakio before? These dark arts are not practiced by our people. But yes, we have experienced the plague of necromancy in the past. Fighting these plagues has always required great sacrifice. Those who have fought the dead have been dishonored, cast out. Cast out on basis of superstition. Most people here deem them to be sacred law, not superstition. Even King Faharajad must respect our customs. If he were to ask his people to disrespect their ancestors, his rule would swiftly come to an end. Oh, oh I have a level up and hopefully more world stuff to do. I have one point. I have use of all my points. Okay, I acted some more things uh, after I quit last time, just to let you know. I got... Oh, wait, you all already know about this stuff. Um, I got Devour. I got Pursuit and Blood Rage. And I think I... made this one into Hunt with Less. And, uh, Hercene Rage was the second form. Uh, Hercene's Rage allows for me to uh, gain health, but if I am full health, it'll increase my max damage for 10 seconds, but increase the damage I take for 10 seconds. 10% more damage is actually quite substantial. To walk us breath. How could we have left so many bodies beneath the waves for this long? Had we cared for our honored dead properly and buried them, none of this would have happened. You have to die for the dead if they're in the water. Hello, Nier. I guess you don't want to talk. Suspicious monkey. I know there's a way up. I accidentally found it earlier, didn't I? Am I going the wrong way? I am going the wrong way. I'm guessing these were barriers. They set them on lights of the... You brought Constable Pascal to justice, didn't you? That poor man. Huh? 
Barn of Justice, how dare you? Puppy! We should get pet the puppies on here. You know, Fortnite allows you to do that now. I don't really have anything happening here. I do above. Oh, fuck. How do I get up there? Is through the Fighters Guild? What is that magical sound? There's a little plate of magic beans. Oh, nope. This did not allow me upstairs. Oh, there's stairs over here. Do -do 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 -do. <laughs> hello, hello, fighters guild. Now is the time. Ildari must act fast. The dead have returned to the sea, yes? Ildani's moment is slipping away quickly. Moment for a good opportunity. Are you interested in a good opportunity? Are we stealing something? I'm not very sneaky. The kind that would help fatten Ildani's purse. Yours too. Not very This whiskers. one sailed into Sentinel docks before the dead. Guards don't stop the dead, but they stopped Ildani. Locked this one in chains. Why did they lock you up? Where there are wants, Ildani provides, but the Sentinel guards don't approve. Mm -hmm. They seized this one's wares. Ildani is free now, but needs her wares back. With all the chaos on the docks, now is the best moment to strike. You will help, yes? Sure, I don't belong to this government. Guards are holding Eldani's wares in the customs house, on the hill overlooking the docks. If you help Eldani recover them, it will be worth your time. The Bandari take good care of their friends. Bandari sounds familiar. What kind of wares are you talking about? Ugh. Laws in Alekir are so strict. So many things are banned, but should not be. The Bandari specialize in wares like this. No <laughs> cause to complain, though. Can be very profitable for us if you help. I'm assuming she means Skuma. How did you escape from being locked up? <laughs> Ildani knows well how to slip out of metal bracelets. Among the Bandari, the Jakajit learned this before they learned to lace their boots. Uh -huh. And who are the Bandari? Bandari are very special tribe of Kajit. We lost our homeland many generations ago, so now we travel, not just in elsewhere, but all over Tamriel. We sell exotic goods you cannot find anywhere else. Ildani brings Bandari wares to Sentinel. Well, can you just tell me you're selling drugs, dude? Uh, okay. I'm gonna kill some guards, I think. Oh, I broke my toes. Knock, knock, they're coming in and taking your shit whether or not you want me to. Seems to care I'm in here. Now he says I'm trespassing. How is that? How is that? I was sneaking in case I was looking at me. You are truly a gift from the god, Seafarer. From Rutka himself, in fact. I see Sue. 
plenty of it. Sack has lotus in it. According to Section 16 of the Sentinel Docks Trade Regulations, this is a restricted area. If you remain here for an extended period of time, I'll be required to place you under arrest. This is for your whole compensated goods. It is. And we're on high alert right now. A Bandari smuggler named Ildani escaped from the guard, and we suspect she might try to reclaim her contraband. If you see anything suspicious, let me know. Are you the only one guarding this? At the moment, I am. My partner stepped away to go moisten the sand. But if you're planning to pull a fast one, know I am authorized by Statute 6 to use deadly force if necessary. No, not me. There's a suspicious Khajiit downstairs. Downstairs? Just now? Damn it! That has to be Ildani. I could catch her right now, but according to Regulation 12, I can't leave my post. I... I've just got to make an exception. Will you watch this area for a few minutes? Sure, go get her. You can count on me. Those monkeys won't escape me. Monkeys is a fucking cat. He's a... Did you find Ildani's wares? This one was worried that the guards might sniff our plan out. No, they're they're dumb. Ah, you do spotless work, Walker. Now the goods must be delivered, though. Ildani worries that the guards might be looking for her, but the risks can sometimes be fun, yes? I could deliver the goods for you. Ah, you are so kind. You think Ildani is sleek, yes? Sorry. No sweet meat for you, but Ildani will reward if you deliver wares to buyers. A servant at the inn, an apprentice at the smithy, and an alchemist at the market. She just turned down a... Tim, I think she thinks I was starting with her, but I don't know. How do I know I was speaking to the right person? We use a code. Just say, Alakir is so hot, I'd rather be elsewhere. After you've delivered the goods, meet me on the bridge in the center of the city. I'll deliver the goods and meet you there. with that later. One thing at a time, please. Maybe he's over this way? Oh, look at the tiny elephant. Is that a player? Is the player in his tiny elephant? Shoot. Wait. This looks exactly like the place we started out in where what's-his-name was all captured, wasn't it? We've not been here before. Am I crazy? Yeah, I am. This is a, definitely not the bar. Greetings to the Sisters of the Sands. Sit and abide a while. Our inn is. Can't you see I'm reading here? Well, I suppose to give it to you. Welcome to the Sisters of the Sand. Enjoy your stay, and let me know if you need anything. Wait, Nazbat, you're working here? <laughs> Didn't I mention my cousin owned this place? Perhaps it slipped my mind. Alethian and I have been to every tavern in the Covenant, and a few beside. It was time for a rest. 
You should see the man Alethian's taken up with. Quite a charmer. Hmm. It's just someone upstairs. Am I supposed to go upstairs? It is someone upstairs. What the frick do I get upstairs? Huh? If you're not careful, this desert air will turn your tongue to jerky. How about a drink? Yeah. Okay. Your belly growls like a dune ripper. You should sit and abide for a while. Even the mightiest heroes have to eat. Not like the most useless jobs in this game, really. I hope you're enjoying your stay at the Sisters of the Sand. Please be sure to let Rudabin know if you have any problems. I like here is so hot. I'd rather be elsewhere. At last, my patrons were getting anxious. I take it you have a package for me. Yes, here it is. Wonderful! It's just the thing to take the edge off this heat. Rudabed likes to take credit for the success of the inn. I'm guessing my little service is what really keeps them coming back. Mm -hmm. I'm well in. Come, Karam. Have a seat. I just acquired a new deck, and I'm dying to try it out. She's playing cards. I'm afraid you need a few more notches in your belt before you can face me. Raise your rank a bit, then we'll talk. Oh, this is that new card game. Think you can take down this old bear, eh? Get you. I don't know how to play the card game, though. I completely forgot there was an R game. I really should be going. Oh, to oblivion with that. Let's play. Nope. I don't know anything about this game. Brave Wayfarer, fellow undaunted, welcome to my desert. I see you remain unslain. A rarity for an undaunted. Oh, that's not part of the Fighters Creed old thing. I never do their missions. Your desert. No creature, no man walks the sands of the Alec here without my knowing. I watch all see all for that it is mine are there creatures here worthy fighting on the and then daunted many and more but they are mine to claim since you're undaunted i'll share this secret with you hidden among the eastern mountains of alec here is the ancient dwemer fortress volenfell few have braved its halls fewer yet have survived to tell you think there's a challenge there i know you will Though I am less certain you'll prevail. The sands can be unforgiving, but either way, there will be a story to tell. You are undaunted. This one is glad to see a new member. She has nearly run out of bodies to climb over in her glorious rise to the top. Is that a bandage you or a bandana? Twice lucky with this, yes. Magnifico Jalid has been most uncooperative. Of course, where should we begin? Twice Lucky likes your cooperative spirit. Such is the heart of the Undaunted. If you seek great heights, look to the land of Eastmarch, where the frozen tower of Direfrost Keep rises over mountaintops. Ascend its icy walls. Prove you are undaunted. What shall I find there? Creatures of ice and magic, touched by the chill of death, bound by an ancient curse. Nothing too serious. This one had a wonderful time, though a shave skin like you might want to bring a cold. Not my own coat. Why do they call you twice lucky? It's the only way this one's victims ever survive. If they elude her once, she calls them lucky, and sharpens her claws for the next dance. But should they be twice lucky and escape her claws once again, this one will relent and let them go free. That's it for you. Greetings, bold adventurer. I'm Virik the White, servant of the Daggerfall Covenant and honorary member of the Undaunted. It's truly a pleasure to meet you. I'm told the newest members buy the drinks around here. What do you say, friend? What would you like to drink? Oh, anything on the menu will do just fine. Beggars can't be choosers, after all. Here you go. Quite kind of you, my friend. Let us toast to your generosity. 
Yeah, I did not mean to get involved with the Undaunted, and I set out packages to deliver. One of those. I need to go out in the city and look around for glowy stones, though, because they're usually up on buildings and whatnot. What's that cute thing? Oh, it's cute. Speak of the devil. Oh. Yeah, I'll get it in a minute. Is she fairly close to one of my other ones? Sorry, my friend, but my services are by appointment only. I like you so hot. I'd rather be elsewhere. Yes, it's unseasonably warm from here to Bergama. The coastal winds blow in a southerly direction, and Lanelin has the best restaurant in the desert. Do you have the package? It is. Excellent. I was starting to wonder if Ildani finally got her tail caught in a trap. Things would be complicated between us if the guards caught up with her. They did. Well, since I'm down here anyway. Use me, Drinker. Drink it in the doorway. Two or three. I thought I was on number one, but okay. And then to the smithy. We're in the drugs, people. It's a life in the living, even though I've got quite a fat coin pocket. This town is quite spread out, actually. Oh, there's one right there. I was like, what? This sure is such a long garden. If you're looking for assistance, you should speak with Bahrar. I've just begun my apprenticeship. I look here is so hot, I'd rather be elsewhere. I understand. I also hate the heat, my friend. Should I assume you have something for me? Yes, I believe this package is for you. Thank the gods. Better late than never, I suppose. I swear that Khajiit works on a totally different schedule than the rest of us. I was getting desperate. Believe me, an apprenticeship doesn't really pay off my debts. Yeah, you're lucky you get paid for an apprenticeship. There's some intern here. Wow. That doesn't look cool. We're actually listening to those before. <laughs> if you're in an internship like here, you would be a uh, shit out of luck. Here on that bridge. How do I get on that bridge? Go around. I believe this bug might belong to here. Somewhere, I don't know where this bug belongs. Good to see you looking healthy and light on your feet, Walker. Did your deliveries go smoothly? Yes, Ildani I... takes your presence here as a good sign. Yes, I delivered them all. Very good. This one knows you wanted something more. Personal. But 
Ildani cannot oblige. She thought I was she wanting to pity on her. Reward, though. And like you, Walker, Ildani delivers. Wow. <laughs> he thought I wanted the pussy's busy. Yeah, I'm here for the money, Adani. I'm going to talk to her again. <laughs> Your advances are <laughs> sweet, Walker. Maybe we will cross paths again in the next life, and things will be different. I wonder if she's taken. Okay, go talk to King Bahad Rajad. With all respect, your majesty, this proves our suspicions were well-founded. You should have heeded my father's warning. It is not the place of the dishonor to correct a king, Ashaba. You are dismissed. I meant no disrespect, your majesty, only that you know where to find us. I will take my leave. That was a weird pause. Welcome to Sentinel Wayfair. If you've come about the docks, rest assured, I already know. I regret that you visit during such times. But perhaps your arrival is fortuitous. Perhaps the gods guided you here to help us fight the Withered Hand. Who or what is the Withered Hand? Necromancers. Practitioners of the most vile magic and the bane of the Alakir Desert. It has been many years since we faced such a threat. I hope the rumors about this group, the Withered Hand, were untrue. But today's events prove otherwise. Where did the Withered Hand come from? Several years ago, a diabolical necromancer named Satura led an army of undead against me. Satura was defeated, but the rumors suggest his sons have returned for revenge. They are Sounded calling nice, themselves right? the Withered Hand. So the necromancer at the docks was with them? Undoubtedly. But I suspect the attack at the docks was merely a feint. I fear the Withered Hand is planning something far worse. Or it was a strike at another side, not quite a feint. A feint is it a fake attack? That was quite an attack, actually. Unless he made a distraction, which, you know... Could be. Usually you launch another attack from another side while you distract them. Uh, that is the challenge I now face. The people of the Alakir Desert, even those in Sentinel, are superstitious. They believe that striking the dead carries a terrible curse. For them, it is an act of dishonor. I will help however I can. That is why I need you, Wayfarer. I will help however I can, Your Majesty. Then your visit is fortuitous indeed. My own son... Prince Azar has been investigating the rumors about the Withered Hand. He is a bright young man, but he needs help. First, though, I would ask you to inform General Thoda of what has befallen. General Thoda? I met him in Alcar. Yes, that is likely. General Thoda is my chief military advisor. He is also a practical man who places security above superstition. He is resting at his home after returning from al -Kir, but I need his counsel on how to proceed. I'll go speak with General Thoda right away. General Thoda is a trusted advisor, and a good friend. He has heard the rumors about the Withered Hand, and he can help us. Tell no one else, though. People remember Satura, and hearing his sons have returned could cause a panic. How did you defeat Satora? It's quite a tale, and I cannot do it justice now. But the battle against Satora was the most difficult of my life, both in military and political terms. It was the Ashaba who saved us. They had the thankless task of fighting the undead. Who are the Ashaba? The Ashaba. Where do I begin? 
They walk among us, but only in shadows. People believe they are cursed. They are dishonored warriors, bound by the sacred oath of their forefathers. They must fight the dead when called upon to do so. Where are they now? I have not called on them. I have even disregarded their warnings. You must understand. The common people despise them. To call on them again might cost me the crown. That is why I must rely on you, Wayfarer. Did the Alakir ever face an undead threat before the Ashada? Yes. The greatest threat the Alakir faced from the undead was in the first era, when the Okudan rulers were still establishing a foothold here. That was when the Ansei wards were created. The what? They are our greatest hope, for no matter how great a threat the Withered Hand may pose, they cannot even compare to the necromancers of the first era. The wards contain the spirits of three Ansei heroes who sacrificed themselves to protect us. And how do they work? They uphold the covenant with the divines. As long as we consecrate the dead in the name of Tuwaka, they cannot be raised by even the most powerful necromancy. Thus, the Withered Hand can only raise corpses that have not been consecrated. Where do these superstitions come from? It is not an ancient Yokudan custom, but a tradition that developed in the desert. Human remains decay slowly here, and our people came to believe their ancestors' corpses were sacred. To harm one would draw the ancestors' curse. They still believe that? Of course. You see, the culture of the Alakir evolved around this ideal. Many of us today realize that exceptions must be made. But in my position, to ask my soldiers to strike down the dead would cause an outcry and possibly lead to rebellion. I do believe you have another one of those, uh, ladies who... If you have come to speak shadows. with the king, the gods smile upon you, for he is holding court. Do not presume to waste his time, though. He has urgent matters to deal with, and has no time for trifles. How about truffles? Well met, champion. Your deeds on the docks have done the city a service. You take a great risk in striking the Ranitu, but perhaps Tuwaka's curse does not extend to the outsiders. Bah! It's a matter for priests. Tuwaka's curse? Yes. Tuwaka, the caretaker of souls. He does not look kindly on those who would strike his honored children. At least, this is what I was taught. In such times, even my faith is shaken. Something has to be done. I do not dispute this. I only hope for your sake that the tricky god feels the same. Tricky? You have the king's <laughs> gratitude, Wayfarer. The news of your exploits has reached the throne. While we cannot publicly condone violence against our honored dead, the fact remains that you have made the city safe. At least for the moment. Uh, I'll talk to him later or something. Let me go find uh, the guy I met over in... Taking your breaks area. At his house? Jesus. It's fair sized. And well furnished. Oh, yes, you. And Nimayama. You. I know you from all care. You roughed up so many of my bravos. Tamriel is a small place, after all. I just returned from all care myself, back in my chair, drinking my wine with my wife. Wait. Please tell me you're not here to disturb me. King Paharjad sent me. It's about the withered hand. No! You realize what this means? Not one moment of relaxation, not one. <laughs> Damn it. I thought this talk about the Withered Hand was just rumor. Are you sure this is true? Yes, someone summoned dead to attack the docks as you show up after. The Sentinel docks? The nerve. But it sounds like something those motherless dogs would do. 
I tell you, Wafa and Alassan might just be more dangerous than their father. Who are Wafa and Alassan? Wafa and Alassan are the sons of that old bastard Satura. They're calling themselves the Withered Hand as a fear tactic. I knew them when they were boys. They're the same age as Prince Azar. Speaking of whom, we should inform him as well. The king said Azar had been investigating the Withered Hand. Exactly. He knows more about this business than I do. That's for sure. If you'll go round up the prince, I'll have to find some way to explain to my wife why I'm leaving again. Then we can all meet at the palace. Where can I find the prince? My guess is that he's with the girls at his seraglio by the north wall. I know what you're thinking, but it's not because the prince is some kind of ladies' man. The girls help him gather information. Perhaps he'll already know what's happened. I'll go look for him right away. My hope is that Prince Azar might have a lead on where Uwafa and Alassan have set up their headquarters, or better yet, what they're planning next. Regardless, these are things we should discuss at the palace. Did Princeton know Uwafa and Alassan as well? We all do. Zatura was one of the king's viziers, kept his little hobby a secret. Then one day the king came to meet his viziers and found them all dead. The real surprise was when Satura ordered their corpses to attack. That's how it started. How did you know the sun so? I tried to train them in swordplay. Uwafa and Alassan along with Prince Azar. Those two had no interest though. I would always catch them torturing insects and animals. The prince, he hated them. And they hated him right back. I thought it would be so glamorous to be married to the king's favorite general. I was wrong, though. It is not glamorous. It is just lonely. You married your husband for glamour. You married your husband for the wrong reason, lady. You married your husband because you like him. Captain Thayer certainly found a bumper crop of guard recruits at Horfrost Downs. I wonder how he did it. Definitely had nothing to do with me, I'm sure. Anything you can give. The game won't let me give you a thing, sir. All of these. Uh oh. I should have tried to stop them. I'm sorry. So sorry. What have I done? What happened? It was a nightmare. These savage men burst into the Seraglio. They struck down the guards and even sweet little Rohiba. And then they took the prince. Please, could you... Would you go after them? You have to. Of course. Did you see where they took him? No. Yet another way in which I failed. I should have followed them out into the street. I'm such a fool. Maybe someone else out there saw them. Maybe they can tell you which way those men took the prince. It's fine. You have to help the lady. Huzzah. Huzzah, is that you? What happened? I feel so... dizzy. Your friend is, uh... getting in and out of life there. Existence. Dog, oh, what are you doing? Bear, what are you doing? The Prince, someone help! They took him! I saw them running! They went west! That way. They went that way. They took the prince down the path. Hurry! This old guard, what the frick are you doing? I tried, but they got me with their evil magic. They took the prince. Down there. I think it leads out of the city. Please, go stop them. Yay, a dungeon. You know what that means. This is not a dungeon. This is a this is a disappointment. Still.
Oh, hello. Well then, I don't recognize you, but under the circumstances, I'm certainly glad to make your acquaintance. You will be well rewarded for assisting me. I can promise that much. I'm glad, glad I found you, Your Highness. Ah, so you do know who I am then. Did my father put you up to this? Is he keeping tabs on me? Well, I shouldn't be so accusatory. If he was tracking me, then I guess that turned out to be extremely fortunate. I don't wish to seem ungrateful, but you should know that kidnapping me was just a distraction. The Withered Hand, they've been planning this for years. If only we had heard the rumors sooner. At this point, I don't think we can stop them. I'm doing what? I'm tunneling into the impervious vault. This tunnel was just one of their attempts. It's a brilliant plan, really. The gates of the vault have been magically sealed for centuries, but underneath, the vault's apparently not so impervious. Why do they want to break into the vault? Undoubtedly, they're hoping to steal the Anse wards. With the wards, Wafa and Alasan could become unimaginably powerful. It could be bad. Really bad. Even if we can't stop them, we have to try. We should get back to the palace and tell my father. Sure, let me untie you. Let's head south. There's a ladder leading up into the city. Okay, so no Dell. No dungeon. I think I'd see you again. Duchess Lacana's remains have been consecrated. Her rites have finished. Soon, she'll be moved to the royal tomb. Now the populace can gather to mourn Sentinel's favorite daughter. I must mourn, my friend. Uh, are you That's holding up? question. I've known the Duchess since we were children. We grew up together. Now she's dead. Nothing will ever fill the hole in my heart. I'll take some comfort in seeing her here at home with her family. It's where she needs to be. I vaguely remember what's going on, but I remember her. Just a coin. All due. Not the Duchess. So much. Yeah, I'll refresh my memory later. Go on and tell my father what they're planning. I'm going to call the guard to the vault. Probably need a bandage or two on your stomach by the looks of it. reach me of what happened at the Seraglio. I should have seen this coming. Please, tell me you found Prince Azar, and he is safe. Yes, and at heart. I told Tola you'd come through. I had a feeling about you, right from the start. Tell me, though, where is Azar? And was this the extent of the Withered Hand's plot? Or do they presently plan some further insult to my family? My Z kingdom. Zal went to, into the impervious vault. He says they're trying to tunnel in. Blade's Edge. How could they? Would that actually work? If they get into the vault, they could steal the Anse wards. And then we must hurry. We have to stop them at all costs. What can I do to help? I can take guards to the impervious vault, but we're going to need help from the Mages Guild. As much as I hate to admit it, only they know how to unseal the vault. Will you go to the guild for me, Wayfarer? Sure, but this sounds like a trigger. Are you sure your son's on lead? When you reach the Mage's guild tower, speak to Gabrielle. She understands the need for discretion. I will meet you at the impervious vault. To walk or watch over you, Wayfarer. Let us hope we can keep the Anse wards from falling into enemy hands. What exactly are the Anze Wards? Of course. If you were not raised here, you would not know. 
The Anse Wards were created centuries ago. The first time necromancers threatened the people of the Alakir. They were created to protect us from the risen dead. They don't seem to be doing a very good job. Or perhaps the protections are not so evident. The Anse Wards maintain our covenant with Tuwaka. If we consecrate our dead, those dead cannot be raised. Thus, the Withered Hand can raise only unconsecrated corpses. So where are all these coming from? Our priests perform the consecration ritual at funerals. But if the corpse is lost, this is not possible. Additionally, Sotora was also fond of murdering people and raising them right away. They assume the Withered Hand is doing the same. What happens if they steal the Anse Wards? It would be unthinkable. With the Anse Wards, the Withered Hand could raise our most honored ancestors. Legendary warriors who were heroes in life, but would be most terrible enemies in death. That is why they must be stopped. Okay. I hope you realize what you've gotten yourself into. Once you're in Faharajad's inner circle, you'll never get a moment's rest. I know this from personal experience. <laughs> Jeez. Poor dude. Sounds like he's working retail. When I heard the commotion from the docks, I came here. There is no safer place than the House of the King. Is it not so? That is probably true. There's one place the bad people, I mean the bad people, Jesus, the guards strike back at the, not bad guys, but the dead. He'll be there. Hello, monkey. Shock the monkey. This shit's so over here. You should sit here all day, lady. What an interesting collection of tomes. What are you doing here, Naramo? Research. Now that you have dealt with that business on the docks, I can once again pursue my passion. The desert hides many Dwemer ruins, most unexplored. You found anything interesting? Oh, yes. More than you can imagine. This will be quite an adventure. Fortunately, I have Vimi along to handle the stabbing. She's proven quite useful. Between her and Clanker, I need no other assistance. What do you have to find in these ruins? The secret of their disappearance. The path to the beyond. Or a few relics that will sell for a great deal of coin. Who can say for certain? You should ask yourself which is more important. The question or the answer? This is the tanker standing outside. Impressed, are you? I have once again taken an opportunity to upgrade him. His central cog matrix has developed quite extensively as a result of our travels. This latest form is his most useful yet. Hey, I don't remember seeing him when I came in. Tanker? Oh! Wasn't playing here a little spider bot? It's a freaking. Rimmer. <laughs> Hello, Vivi. At last, we're finally going to explore a real set of ruins. Just Naramo and Clanker and me. And Clanker doesn't take a split. I'm so looking forward to this. Clanker. I swear he was like a spider. Ooh, don't do that. Gabrielle. Hey, I know you. We killed that crazy old necromancer oh, together. Oh, right. Angoth. Remember that midnight talisman we used to break into Cathedral? I still can't believe that worked. So I don't suppose you need help with something fun like that. King Faharajad needs your help to break into the Imperius vault. Are you joking? I've been wanting to take a crack at that place ever since I heard the name. Wait a minute. 
Did Simone put you up to this? Why would the king want to break into the vault? It's true. Necromancers are trying to steal the Ansei wards. Necromancers? Ansei wards? Fascinating. Count me in. So we just need to break the seal? Hmm, I know. Let's try this. Go to the bazaar and get Flamestock from Lucien and Worm's Headcap from Nineba. Then meet me at the vault. This could work. Flamestock and Worm's Headcap. Lilia, that sounds... Oh, yeah, she was, like, leader or something. Well met. I'm the resident librarian. Oh, that's not her. We don't have much, but what we have, I care for. Have you found anything to add to our collection? She's like an exact model of the other lady, but that is not her voice. I don't remember what happened to the other lady. Your kids been giving you any troubles, Red Bar Mage? There is a stigma, though nothing is said to my face. Only when I show them my back do they speak. But I know that my work aids our people. I have only the eight and my conscience to answer to. Sounds good to me. Here you go, lady. I know Mimi. Mimi. Hi, Clanker. You keep eating your Wheaties. Okay, it's what an hour and a half in now. I don't need much. An hour. And... Okay, so I'm gonna ahead and take a pause here. I'm going to uh, say. Hello and welcome to my stream if you're watching this on YouTube especially. Um, well, I guess the VOD or the streamers too. If you're watching this and you're not a live stream, then please go to the link and look at my book and support it by buying it. Five dollars, a hundred thousand words. It's a werewolf, which is our theme of the stream tonight, though we haven't been a werewolf too much in this stream. Um, in this episode, I should say. But it would help me greatly if y'all sh... Share it if y'all like it. If y'all don't like it, throw it back in my face, whatever. But if y'all like it, share it with your friends. Show them what you like. Get my name out there. If anything comes from this... Uh, why do I have a search around me? If anything comes from my writings, it will be up to you, my fans and friends and family. That's it. I have to rely on y'all. If I can get out there, I can write, and I can make a little bit of money, I can take care of my son, myself, my mother, and I can even play more if I make a lot of money. I don't even need to have donations here if I'm selling books. Take your time and browse, my friend. I'm sure you'll find I have what you've always wanted. Get any worms headcaps. Oh, this is for Gabrielle, isn't it? She's a regular. In a city like Sentinel, we Bretons have to stick together. I have some in stock. You're welcome to them. Don't worry about payment. I know Gabrielle's good for it. You have any flame stocks? I'm sorry, but I'm out of stock. Because I'm out of stocks. <laughs> Seriously, though, some Lion Guard mages came through and bought my last batch. Nina Bond, the lizard trainer, might have some. I'm going to assume I already got your stock. Got it, got it. Oh, how cute. Welcome to Nina Bond's Emporium of Strange and Wonderful Things. Can I interest you in a lizard catching net? Or perhaps a trained lizard? You have any, uh, oh, that's a big lizard. Oh, you must be Monkey. Yes, he is adorably large, isn't he? I'm afraid I spoil him. Only the best bugs are good enough for my monkey. He's quite smart, aren't you, Monkey? Quite a little smarty. You named your lizard Monkey? Yes, it may seem odd. But it makes sense to me. From the time I could walk, I wanted a pet monkey. I pleaded and begged, but my father always refused. Monkeys are arboreal, he said. I still don't know what that means. I don't know what that means either. <laughs> so you got a lizard instead. It has to start somewhere. Monkeys are terrific. Everyone loves monkeys. And if I can't have a monkey, a lizard's the next best thing. You know, sometimes I wonder how my life would be different if my father had only given me a monkey. Me too. So, do you have any flame stalks? Flame stalks? Tasty treats. They help with indigestion. Or a lizard, at least. You're not a lizard. What do you need them for? For some spell with Gabrielle, I bet. And she doesn't even like lizards. Oh well, just take them. 
but she owes me. Yes, she does. How do I get down here? Oh. I feel like we're opening the vault so the bad guys can get in and we're all being played and the king's being played. Everybody's being played. Spare any coins? Spare any coins? Spare any coins? Spare any coins? Sorry. <laughs> Watch him. I hear the tinkering of a. Uh, Maybe of some sort. It's, I saw some kind of black arrow show up. Aha, perfect. Say, though, you didn't happen to pick up a few giant's toes while you were at the bazaar, did you? No one told me to. That's fine. Giant's toes could make a bigger gap in the seal, but they're probably hard to find here anyways. These should do the trick, I think. Hmm. Worm's head on top of the flame stock, or flame stock inside the worm's head. Are you sure you know what you're doing? Oh, absolutely. It's only one person going in anyways. Without the giant's toes, I can only open the seal so far. Of course. Baharajad thinks that one person should be you. He wants to talk to you first, though. Go on up. Aren't you going to open the vault? Sure. I just need a minute to think about how exactly to word this. Hmm. Gotta... Gotta... Tabra... 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 Gotta... Go on. I'll be right up. Ooh. Experimental magic. You're not what tempted to say, I'm sorry you became caught up in all this, but something tells me it was the hand of fate that brought you here. Besides, if we can't stop them from stealing the Anse wards, none of us are safe. Well, here, so maybe you're not the evil one. If we are too late, the implications are unthinkable for all of Alakir. I have prayed to Tuwaka, Stindar, and even Akatosh. Though I do not hold them sacred, I will pray to the Yokudan gods as well. Don't worry, your Just majesty. In case. Everything will work out. Your hope is contagious, Wayfarer. I am pleased that your road has led you here. General Thoda is not a man of faith, but even he agrees your coming seems more than a coincidence. If only one of us can enter the vault, I think it should be you. I am willing to be the one. I cannot adequately express my gratitude. You must be careful, though. Azar believes the Withered Hand is far more powerful than we realized. Uwafa and Alassan in particular. If you see either of them, I suggest you exercise extreme caution. Thank you for your concern, Your Majesty. I pray that we are not too late to stop the Withered Hand. And with the same breath, I thank the gods for guiding you here. To walk a watch over you, Wayfarer. Here comes Gabrielle. Are you ready? Yes. Stand back, your majesty. I hope you realize what I'm you've done. I'm not sure how the vault will react. I hope this works. Oh. It worked. Go quickly. I don't know how long it'll stay open. I should have almost werewolf powers activated by now. Kinda wish they also charged slowly over time instead of just me beating up people. Get out of here. They've broken into the vault. Stop them, fools!
Those steps. Oh, I guess they're going to try and raise this one up. Almost. Run, 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 run. Zombies. Thank you. Like human turkey, I'm sure. You are not marked with the corruption of undeath, nor those that foster it. You are not aligned with them. Are you? No, I was trying to stop them. You sought to protect the wards? Praise Tuaka. That means there are still living those who oppose the menace of necromancy in the Alakir. Hearken closely then, for my spirit cannot abide here long. I'm listening. We sacrificed ourselves to create the wards, and through them we have protected the consecrated dead. But the wards have fallen into corrupted hands now, and we are powerless to stop them. You must recover the wards. Where are they? I do not know. My sight is weakened, and my presence is tied to my ward. They have taken it far from here. That is why I am fading. Find the wards. Bring them back. To walk be with you. I'll do everything I can to recover the outside wards. We will meet again. Whoops. Alright. Am I going? Sorry. Let's see. 
bad guys. I guess I ate the last bad guy. Um, is there a less perilous way down? No. They just want me to fall. Blood of her enemies, dripping blood from the only blood from her mouth. That took longer than I hoped. It's hard to be patient when I know the fate of my kingdom is at stake. Tell me you have good tidings. Or did they escape with the Anse Wards? They escaped with the Anse Wards. Damn it all! Hilda said Satura's sons were dangerous. That's certainly true now. With the Anse wards, they can raise an army faster than I can. We have to stop them. We have to send Uwafa and Alasan to join their father in oblivion. I've done everything in my power to avoid calling on the Ashaba. But I no longer have a choice. We must have their help to recover the Anse wards. I would avoid contacting them directly, however. Will you be my envoy, Wayfarer? Sure. Thank you. Most of the Ashaba live together, wandering the desert, going gods nowhere. Track them down, and tell their leader, Marima, that the Alakir needs him again. We need the Ashaba to fight the Withered Hand. Where should I start? The Ashaba often spend this season camping at Morwas' bounty to the south. God's willing, perhaps they are still there. Marima sent his daughter to warn me of the Withered Hand. They wanted to help. I regret that I turned them away. I will find them and ask them how to... Ask them to help now. I hope I need to remind you to keep this quiet. Rumors will spread about the Withered Hand. But we should try to keep the theft of the Anse Wards a secret. I have many political enemies. Who would try to turn this to their advantage. Well, calling upon the Ashimara have be a problem. Of course it will. But what am I to do? Allow my public image to endanger the kingdom? Sometimes a king cannot save his face and his people at the same time. Still, I would prefer we not shout our plans from the rooftops. Finally, my father stops chasing the Mirage. I advised him to listen to Ashaba weeks ago. Better late than never. If you will go speak with Marima, I will reach out to my Ashaba contacts as well. We will find a way to stop the Withered Hand. I just hope the Ashaba are prepared for this. Regardless, I will discreetly begin looking through the ranks for any soldiers who might be willing to do what's necessary. That way, at least we have someone. Fire salts. This is way worse than I realized. The withered hand, eh? When I get back to the tower, I'll see if I have anything on them. It'll be useful when you come ask for my help again, which I'm sure you will. It's just so cheerful and weird. Dog, stop sniffing the salt from the roof. Oh, oh, Nothing else in here I needed to do right off the bat? I guess not. I see anything pop up on the roof. Oh, how do I get out of town? Here we go. Here we go. Wow, that is uh, not extremely publicly out of town, but it'll work. Let's 
Okay, I'm gonna add an overseer. This is truly a sign from Rudka. In the sand, beetles. Behind the rocks, beetles. Around the Johards, beetles. I was trying to Last night I woke up and one was in my tent just... Just watching me. We can't do our work. Sentinel's going to run out of water. What's happening with the beetles? They've overrun our camps. Any time we approach the rain catches in the center of the fields, we get attacked. But that's it for me. I'm done dodging bugs. You want to help? Speak to Overseer Jahi. She's in charge. This is her problem. Talk to her then. That reminds me, I have. First thing the Sea of Werewolf is anything since I've been using it. Who has it? War. At some point, war with. War with bloodlust. Oh, that's sad. He looks like he dies when you do that. <laughs> World with bloodlust to terrify up the six near by enemies. During them for three seconds, off balance for seven seconds. Let's try it. So, oh. Triangle Howl, oh, Roar. That one and our one. Okay, that'll work. If you've come to buy water, I apologize for the sorry state of the Johads. My idiot brother has all but ruined us. I suppose it'll fall to me to dig the family out of this sand pit. What happened? The water's been contaminated. To top it off, whatever's tainted the Johads seems to attract the desert beetles. Workers won't go near the Johads, and with good reason. But I still need to find out what's contaminated our lifeblood. I'm gonna help. I do. The workers have rest camps in between the Johads. If someone brought in this poison... There may be evidence of it there. If you can find something of import, bring it to me. I'll be at the main Johad down the road. What exactly is a Johad? There are reservoirs. Even in the desert, there is moisture in the air. The rain catchers collect it and funnel it into the Johads. Then we carry the water. Oh my to god, the city it's a moisture farm. Burns. We're in Tatooine. At least that's what we normally do. You mentioned your brother. Who Almor, is he? Where you see the heaviest work done. Look for him elsewhere. This is our family's business. He should show proper pride in our work. Ah, oh, well. I can take care of the Johads once these beetles are gone. Okay. Assassin beetles, I've all your cam before. Vial use against some kind of noxious substance, but there's mostly empty now. Jockey sent you, didn't she? Oh, mirror. Oh, mirror. That smell. It's the same that's coming up from the Johads. Is that what was in the bottle you picked up? Jahi will never believe me, but I want to find out who did this as much as she. Seems to believe it was your fault. I know. And in a way, it is. Our father put me in charge of the Johads after I, um, returned from Sentinel. Within a fortnight, most of the Johads reeked of this musk. Even so, I have no idea how any of this happened. So what's in the vials? So what was in the vial is in the Johads Only now? Only one way to know for sure. A taste test. These three Johads are the ones attracting the most beetles. See if the water has the same flavor as that vial. What is your sister thinking you're involved? She has her reasons, and I respect them as I do her. It would make no difference if I defend myself now. The important thing is that we find out what's happened to the Johads. Well, you seem actually quite nice. This guy seems quite dead. We have something here. Ah! 
You thought I might be alone, you damn dirty bug. Ew. Oh no, the monkey died. That's probably the white meat. Well then. I'm just gonna drink this gross ass musk water. So there's a visible tint of sickly green in the water. The bitter taste is very strong. I'm sure that's not going to give me cancer. Some pieces from the bug. Water looks okay. So far, I'm just in it. Water has a better flavor. Not at all like the rain water should taste like. They're not green like the other one. Less tainted. Tastes sweet, but sounds a distinct smell that matches the contents of the bottle. Wow, there's friggin' beetles everywhere. Holy cow. If the beetles rush us, I will give my life to buy a few moments for the others to escape. My son died in the fields, and I hold no fear in my heart at the thought that I might join him. Sorry, lady. It's my job to keep the beetles in check normally, but something has gotten them riled up. I'm a farmer, not a warrior. I don't have the weapons or skills to deal with this. I do. Alright, I guess I killed several of the beetles. Hello? Okay, stop talking night shade and talk to the lady. I think I almost got away from the family business. Father giving it to my younger brother seemed like the perfect compromise. But look where it's brought us. Have you found anything? The vial was in one of the camps. The contents match what is in the Johans. I recognize this. It's the same kind of vial my brother's wife uses for her alchemy. Is she responsible for this madness, I wonder? Where's your brother's wife? Ohama is a Khajiit apothecary from Sentinel. I, I had no quarrel with her, but if she's responsible for this, my father must know. She cares for him in the house just beyond here. Father didn't approve of their marriage, of course, but she is very skilled. It was to revenge the fact that your dad's a racist. On you, Wayfarer. Do you have a thirst that I can satisfy? Sure, huh? I'll calm down in a minute. I hear you squeaky, but I don't see you. There you are. I welcome you to my father's home. Please excuse our scant hospitality. 
I've been tending to Naseran day and night, and it leaves little time to prepare for guests. How may I aid you? You recognize this file. It is mine. A rare bug musk, used in some Bosmer cooking, if I recall. I thought I'd misplaced it on the trip here. Tell me, where did you find it? It's the same substance as contaminating the Johans. Blessed barn. Tuwaka, I beg you keep your voice down. My father-in-law would truly turn me out if he heard such rumors. Can I help you, ma'am? How could it be? I swear upon my very claws, I had nothing to do with the Johans. You must believe me. Could someone have stolen it from you? Still, I would not know. Many of the workers come in and out of the house for refreshments. So perhaps one of them took it. But still, why would they do such a thing? <sighs> there is one way to find out who took the bottle. Oh, what's that? It is strange, but wait and listen. Outside, a woman peddles her trained lizards. Ask if her pets can track scents, such as this bug musk. Just holding the vial leaves a residue on the Hey, tides. don't knock over it. Hey, don't fuss at me. Don't knock over shit. You'll find who stole it. <laughs> Sneaky little cat. What are you doing up here? This is usually a cheese spot. Where's your uncle? <laughs> Cute. <laughs> Cute. Strange cat. I've run these Johad since I was a young man. Damned if I'll see them fall to another. Oh, is your father in law? Okay. I thought this was your father. I was like, that's a human. I don't know, I'm not even sure humans and Kajits can mate. I think that was like a discussion in this. Either a novel from Skyrim or a novel from this game. Greetings, Sandwalker. I can tell by that look in your eye. You know lizards. Do they speak to you? Do you enjoy the feel of their cool scales against your cheek? Yes, you understand. I know you do. Uh, sure. Do you have any lizards that can detect scents? Of course. Did you know lizards smell with their tongues? They are quite adept at detecting even the faintest trace of a scent. I have a fine tracking lizard if you're interested in purchasing one. I'll even train him to the scent of your choice. I feel like intimidating is the wrong thing to do here. It's not like she's she's running a job. I'll take them. I have you have spent that. your gold very wisely, Sandwalker. Give me the scent, and the lizard will be yours. And cursed, I tell you. These lands are cursed. The desert belongs to the dead. Rupka sent the beetles as a sign. They'll just keep coming, more and more beetles, until we leave. A friendly one, isn't it? What an adorable lizard. Come here, little one. Okay. confused about the interaction. Was that her, by the way? We'll go back to her, but it was her. She wouldn't let me do anything with her. She just kept interacting with my lizard.
Ah, stop Hold. biting this me, This has gone lizard. on long enough. I don't know who you are, but if you seek the one responsible for the Johads, you do so backwards. Come, Jahi should hear this as well. I'm tired of secrets. Okay. I'm biting the lizard. He kicked my lizard. How dare he? He's so rude. There's no denying that some of the workers made some bad decisions. But they're not the one who orchestrated it. They were bribed to administer that poison to the Johads. They swore they had no idea it would bring disaster upon us. The poison came from Mahama. She said it was stolen. And it probably was. The man I spoke to was no Khajiit, though that is all I can say about him. He was hidden from view when we first spoke, his voice muffled. I refused to take his gold. But I knew sooner or later someone would. You know anything else that can help me? Some of the workers said the payoff location was inside the house. That was before the Beatles came. After that, no one wanted anything to do with this strange man's scheme. I'd search there for any sign of who this person was. It is not as it seems. I love Almor with all of my being. Why would I do anything to hurt the ones he loves? Come to you, sir. Search the house. As Faramuz says, if you find nothing, I must assume Ohama's lying and throw her and my fool brother out. That is, if he ever shows up again. Yeah, the, your brother's absence is a little iffy. A lot of us around here. A couple of investigators. Squeaky, you've been on my bed lately. What are you doing up here? And this is your uncle's spot. He's gonna be jail, jail. Where did Pop go? Is this not the same house Pop was in? My leftover food smells the same musk in the Joe Hogs. Either the food's been poisoned, or the person's handling the food in musk. After handling the musk bed, Jahi's father slept here a little while ago. He's no longer in bed, but there's no signs of a struggle. He left. Oh, he was sick. Got poisoned. Left. Maybe he handled it himself. Ohama keeps her potions in the dresser. There are several broken bottles inside, as if someone was searching for something quickly and carelessly. I can't believe my sister thinks Ohama had something to do with this. Where is father? I demand to talk to him. He's not here, but it looks like the, the, the one responsible for the Johad was. What? And father is gone too? Do you think they've done something to him? Sep spit. What else could go wrong? What have you found in your search? The same musk is all over the horse. Then whoever else was else. in here smells yeah. of it too. We need some way to detect the scent and follow their trail. I have a lizard that attracts scent to bite people. Brilliant. You follow the trail and my sister and I will spread out to look for father. They can't have taken him far. He is an old man after all. Unless, of course, he is the one I'm looking for. I'm sorry, I don't mean to sound bitter, but I've been in Skyrim. I've been in Elder Scrolls before. What are you doing, lady? <laughs> Follow who, what, where? See a frick fracking trail. Get out of that. We were actually getting ahead for a change, storing extra barrels of water for Sentinel. Even after we clear the beetles out, we'll be struggling to catch up. 
The rain catches supply water to the Sentinel. Yes, or at least most of it. You can't drink seawater, and we don't have a lot of rivers in Alakir, so our ancestors were forced to be clever. My family has been working the fields for generations. Hopefully, they will for many more. How do rain catchers work? It's fairly simple. They catch the morning dew and funnel it into the Johads. We use large urns to transport the water from the Johads to Sentinel. Ah. Huh. Interesting to think of. It's my time. job to keep the beetles in. I honestly have no idea where the friggin' lizard is. If the beetles rush us. I have no idea where the frick. Seems my secret is a secret no more. Father, are you all right? Wasn't expecting to run into a beetle. It must have followed my scent. You poisoned the Johats? But why? Father, your wound. My last wish was for the Johats to remain within the family. But. <laughs> It costs nothing but strife. No, you can't die. Not now. Are you all the way over there? Listen, I wish for your happiness. Promise me, the Johads. We will find happiness, Father. I swear to you. I'm confused. This is my fault. I'm the one who wanted to sell the Johads. My father deserved better than this. Uh, less confused. What now? It falls to one of us to take charge of the Johads. Father always wanted me to have them, but I feel I'm the one who truly betrayed the family. I'll talk to him more about it. Father's dead. And for what? Some false sense of security that we won't sell the Johads? I'll never understand. What now? It falls to one of us to take charge of the Johads. Father always wanted Jahi to have them, but she's never wanted them. Neither of us have. And I know what to do with them as well. I'm selling them to another family to run. Oh. This place has seen more than its fair share of strife. I'm done. And then what? It's the only way to end our bickering. After all this, I feel we need to be a family again. Strong, united. And my sister's the only one of my blood left. Your sister? But you hate each other. Blood is thicker than water, after all. With the money we'll get from this place, I can buy us a good home in Sentinel. Ohama will welcome my sister, even after all this. She's beautiful that way. Creepy looking dude here. It's best this way. I did not want the responsibility, and Almor's decision seemed wise to me. Perhaps my little brother is smarter than I've given him credit for. I agree. Do I have like a level up or something? I just keep having things fly by me. Nothing new. Oh yeah, I forgot before I got distracted by that. I was going to a camp. What time is it, guys? We are at two hours. Once again, I'll plug my book. If you are a lover of werewolf novels, go check out the link in the description and over here in the chat. If you are over here in chat and watching me, feel free to ask for a code. You still get a free book. Stop. Look at them left. What is this I'm seeing? Oh. You approach the camp of the Ashaba. Wait. I recognize you from Faharajad's palace. <laughs> he would not listen to us. And now we all pay for his stubbornness. King Faharajad sent me. I need to speak to Marma. Faharajad sent you to ask for our help? 
Now? The nerve of this king. <laughs> well, if you seek my father, you should know he and many other of our warriors are extremely ill. Some are dead. Our water was poisoned. Who poisoned your water? I suspect it was the necromancers, the withered hand, but it is of little importance now. All that matters is finding the ingredients for the antidote. If my father dies, there is no Ashaba for the king to call upon. Will you help me then? I mean, someone could take it over, but sure. Come quickly then. Meet me at my tent in the camp. Okay, found the Ashaba camp, thank you. I'm in the damn Ashaba camp. Stay back, Wanderer. You are welcome to our camp, but our chief is not entertaining guests. Like so many of our warriors, he has been poisoned. Only his daughter may disturb his rest. Keep a shot, shot, whoever. Send to me. We need aid with the uh, da. The king has waited too long. So many warriors have died, and Marima holds on to life by a thread. We will answer the king's call to the best of our ability, but I fear we can do very little. You should speak to Talia if you haven't already. Already have. Why don't she knows Bruce? Twenty points if you know that reference. Thirty points if you know their child's name. Personally, get the here. I've marked on your map where my father says we can find the ingredients. Rice. Lead the way. Not also Italia, but you're related to the Flash. Cool looking rock. Oops. Get some Jupiter, Jupiter early. I will see my fallen brothers and sister avenged, even if it is the last thing I ever do. This wolf will help you. Oh goodness, this one's quite far away. See some palms, not one of these. Do the ruins, the out of here ruins. Oh, that's fun. Lady, you are an archer. You should be at least a robot. Roughly full. That's not what I meant to do, is it? <laughs> My father has been chief of the tribe for 26 years. We would not know what to do without him. And then you do with him. Someone else leading, Jesus. So take the blossoms. Who would have believed the withered hand would poison our water? Uh, why would you believe they wouldn't? They're necromancers. They a bunch of you and make you into soldiers. Good more of those this so wrong. What the book? Oh, what the heck are you? Hello, Cactus. We must uh, cactus hurry. Leaf. So many Ashaba have already died. Whatever, and grab this book first. They're quickly down, it doesn't That's include everything. absolute Meet death. Meet me at my father's tent. Okay. Someone else over there will grab them in a minute. Let's talk for a little bit. Oh my, when will I learn? 
Aha, perfect. You look like the fit sort. I wonder if you can assist me in an archaeological project of considerable importance. I came here searching for some rather valuable relics, but I've encountered something of a setback. What kind of setback? Well, I discovered this fabulous portal in the Aeliad ruins. I sent my assistant through, and it was a mistake. The portal apparently leads to somewhere in the Grotwood, and basically he returned with the Old Mary army at his heels. I am not friends with the elves in this, this um, as is a work. Old Mary forces are in the, through the portal? Yes. And unfortunately, it seems they're now planning a full-scale invasion. Establishing a base, building siege weapons. We need to close the portal, quickly. I discovered an old tome that explains how, if I can find it again. Will you help me? You're sure. a true hero, and I mean that. My camp is beside the ruins. That's where I left the book. Get the book, use it to activate the large pillars in the ruins. Then meet me inside the west door to the lower ruins. Why do I die? Down there. Why activate pillars? I suppose that's a reasonable question. As you might imagine, the elves have locked the main entrance to the portal room. There is a back way, however, through an old prison of some sort. The pillars unlock the door into the prison. What's inside the prison? Oh, I haven't the foggiest notion what's in the prison. It's been centuries, though. Whatever was down there is surely dead. If not, well, you seem capable enough. And it can't be any worse than the damned elves. Can you tell me more about the ruins? My researchers in High Rock gave me the essential background. Solace N was an alien stronghold, built by human slaves in the Marithic era. The elves eventually got what they deserved during the Yokudan colonization of Hammerfell in the First Era. I'll purpose you in the portal, sir. It's quite fascinating, really. It would seem to prove that the Altmer and the Aeliads were still connected further into the Marithic era than we believed. I actually wrote a book on the subject. Well, someone wrote it for me, but who's counting? <laughs> so they're all Murray hoops the ruin. Unless they're sporting Dominion armor as a fashion statement, I'm afraid so. If my assistant had half a brain, he would have let himself be captured rather than lead the Old Mary troops back here. And the Old Mary could actually threaten all the gear? Well, we are at war, and an enemy army this deep into our territory would be a very bad thing. I would hate to think I destroyed the Daggerfall. Okay, so we're gonna ignore her thing for now. We do the one we're doing. Also, lore-wise, let's get up. This is Ardon. What the hell? We're up here. Down here is Abdazalang and Lady Shine. So, yeah, we're pretty far into territory here. The uh, elves did come up about this way and land on the desert and tackle up here in the middle of the stream. It would be heavily, the uh, little sea would be heavily guarded, and they'd have a lot of important strongholds up here. That would be a pretty advantageous port. So, a portal port. Port, port portal? Come through. Um, I'm seeing a gate. Gate is gone. There Please, goes Father, there must be some way. You are welcome oh, to our shit. camp. We are usually generous hosts, but under the circumstances, I, I hope you understand. Of course, I understand. I you like have this, seen, of course. But the tribe is weak. Father. And I am soon to return to the sand. I like the way his eyes are moving. The sacred duty of the Ashaba. That other is you. It has been foreseen. Me? Yes. There can be no doubt. The withered hand. We have never faced such a threat. But it is our duty to stop them. You, you fall, my toe. You must become one of us. You must become an Ashaba. How do I become a Ashaba? Then there is a ritual. My daughter. I told her the ingredients were for an antidote. 
But she knows now. They are for your initiation. There's not much time. You must decide. Are you willing to join us? To become an Ashaba? Dude, I kill zombies for fun. And I'm not technically part of your religious race thing, so why not? Thank you. You can move eat the a great weight as a werewolf. Off of the heart of a dying man. Nothing more Future concentrated than tribe. concentrated by my stomach juices, right, uh, Squeaky? Honor depends on Squeaky you. He agrees because she's a black hole. Our duty and the fighting food. the withered hand. <laughs> you just turned around in the spot, and you're facing the same way you just t t t turned around from. My daughter is not happy right now. She's as stubborn as her mother was. But death will not be stayed. Be assured, though, Initiate. After you complete the trial, she will help you fight the hand if you wish. Uh, yeah. That is good. I believe she has finished mixing the potion for your initiation. Speak to her when you are ready to begin the trial. May Tuwaka guide your path, Initiate. Always. Uh, good night, old man. Ah, he's still moving. The chief is gravely ill. I fear Tuwaka may claim him soon. The great man lies dying over there, and he has put all his faith in you. I hope it is not misplaced. I have finished mixing the potion for your initiation. Whenever you are ready, we can begin the trial. I am ready. Very well. Then here it is. Go to the Mikada in the back of the tent and drink. Be prepared, initiate. The potion will bring on a vision of the past. When the vision is over, you will know what it means to be a Shaba. So, I'm dropping acid. Okay. Acid! We're going on a trip, Squeaky. We're gonna ride on the clouds. Ooh, this trip is less Samir. colorful. Samir! Rouse yourself, or do you want to miss the battle? Samir, my brother, finally you stir. Did you drink too deeply from the starry well last night? This is unlike you. Quickly, pull yourself together. We can afford no idle time today. I'm awake, what's going on? Morwa's mercy. Maybe you took a head bump too. Did you forget about the battle? The regatta will drive these evil elves from our lands for good. I am to fight at your side today, brother. Tell me you still feel up to it. Of course, I am always ready to fight. Now there is the Samir I know. Sometime you will have to tell me what has befallen on this last night. A story of wildness, I am sure. Come now, though. Our father prepares to address the regatta. He is expecting us. I'm still a little foggy. I have some questions first. Samir, I am really starting to worry. Have you been ensorcelled? The year is 853. Our father is King Jaquan, come from old Yakuta to settle here in the Alakir Desert. I hope this is starting to sound familiar. I had a dream something about a tribe called the Ashbada. The Ashaba? These people I do not know. Are they also elves? If we must, we will kill them too. I need you to focus though, Samir. Focus on the battle today. We should hurry to hear father's speech. <laughs> I want to do the rest of them, but these sound like good ones. Like, why must we fight the elves? Like, you're a spy. Shouldn't you give me a little more respect? I think he's my brother. Praise the gods. It would not be proper if we were not present when father makes his speech. He is very likely starting to worry about us himself. Then let us keep him waiting no longer. Lagada, you all know that the elves are outside our walls. These... Infidels call us barbarians. 
They would drive us from this land. But what the elves do not know is that Rupka himself guided us to these shores. He decreed that the Alakir would be our home. Today, the infidels will see the strength of the Shahai. Ansi will guide our blades. Today, the sands will run red with elven blood. <laughs> Strong Samir, my heart is proud. I believe this will be a day of destiny for you and your brother. If we wish to remain here, we must cleanse the land of these elves' taint. I'm sure we'll be victorious. Yes, and much of the glory for this victory will go to you and your brother. I send you forth as my champions to slice through the elves' ranks and find their leader. The snake's head, and then the body will wither and die. We want us to go ahead of the soldiers. Yes, it is a great honor and a great responsibility. But you have proven your valor time and again, Samir. I know you will succeed and clear the way for our people's future. Go now, and go with the gods, my son. You have my blessing. I will go and fight today in your honor, father. I know you will be victorious, my son. May Ansi guide your blade. Give me a moment, Samir. I must make my offering to Ansi. Come to my tent when you are ready to enter the battle. Ah. Uh. Our deeds today will be remembered for generations to come, brother. Lead on. Wait a minute. <laughs> that just turns them into the one. Game should probably block that. Well, now officially in history, this guy is a werewolf. And I'm sure all this bull's going back to my actual pocket back home. People's kneecaps. Apparently, my favorite area is a wolf. Attack. Yeah, quite a. Sorry, bro. Your toes are just too tasty. Yeah, sand. I've got a little, a little bit of sand in my mouth. Oh, those actual players.
<laughs> this is definitely a Dell, and it's getting a little confusing. My I don't know what my timing is at. Gods, look at the walking bones. All these elves have no shame. to keep up with these people. You are too late, Samir. Your father is dead. Even worse, some elven necromancer. He turned your father into an abomination. What do you mean? The necromancer slew your father and then reanimated his corpse. It is the most terrible thing I have ever seen. He is lost. There is nothing to be done for it. I can't just abandon him. I have to do something. Samir, you must not go in there. You would have to strike down your own father. As darkly as these events have transpired, our laws remain sacred. Your father is honored dead. Harm his remains, and you dishonor yourself. So you would just have us flee? Yes. There is no other choice to be made. I know your father would not want us to abandon our new home here, but he could not have foreseen this. He would not have us break the sacred law. You must not even consider such a thing. I'll have to think about it. We should discuss this, Samir. Come with me. Fate has dealt us a cruel hand, my brother. I agree with you. Father would not want us to flee our home. But do we dishonor ourselves? To kill him would mean exile, but... I am willing to do this if you command. Why would they command you to do this? Because it is clear that one of us must make this sacrifice. You are in line to become king now. If you strike our father, you would be throwing all of this away. For me, there is not as much at stake. Just speak the command and I will go, brother. Ah, frick. So really, I think the character would have to strike him down. It's his duty, but... If he's the king, he can't do it. Your sacrifice will be remembered, brother. Do what you must. Thank you. In some ways, this is an honor for me. Let us just hope that all that sparring we did in the courtyard has prepared me for this. If so, I will return momentarily. If not, then this is goodbye. You'll be fine, Hector. I'll wait here. Wow, what the frick? They did a lot in here. He has done us in here. Whatever that thing was, it was not our father. I know that in my heart. 
must respect the law, though. I struck down our father. I desecrated his remains. I must be exiled. There must be some other way. No. Enough tragedy has befallen our kingdom today. I would not disrespect our sacred laws. To attempt to avoid my fate would mean the sacrifice I have made was in vain. You must let me go, brother. You're truly noble, Hawk. Yeah. I'm sorry you must be exiled. Oblivion Rooms. I even brought in a fog machine. Holy cow. I think he's done us in here. Whatever. Who knows if I don't throw him into a loop? Look at that. Definitely wasn't I, uh, coming dead here. Ooh. Didn't know your ancestor was a werewolf. Or at least your ancestor's brother. Welcome back. You were gone for longer than I expected. I trust you walked beside Prince Hakmir of Yath and experienced the events that led to his exile? Yes, he was the first Ashva. He was. Hakmir went on to start a family and a tribe in exile. They wandered the desert as nomads and became known as the Ashaba. Samir became king and ruled peacefully until years later, when he again faced the threat of necromancers and what undead. Happened? What happened then? The colony from Yath would have fallen, but Hakmir led his tribe against the necromancers and their army of risen dead. The Ashaba accepted the dishonor of fighting the dead to save the kingdom. So it has been ever since. I understand. You have now witnessed the first sacrifice, and you know that true honor need not be named. You are one of us. You are Ashaba. We will recognize you as our sister, and together, we will uphold the sacred duty of our tribe. Then my initiation is complete. Yes. The words have been spoken. Normally, my father would conduct a small ceremony and speak the words, but... His spirit moved on while you were unconscious. His last request was that you and I would destroy the Withered Hand. We'll do that. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, let's see what's in my inventory. And then I put some crap in there. I will destroy that. Do that. Do that. Ooh. Better. Most way, always. You. Almost broken, and I really don't need to be more, so I should throw you on the ground. Head, nothing, chest. Health up, spell damage down by a little, health up by a bit. Need more armor, health and damage down by a little. I don't like that, spell resistance. It's not enough of an improvement for me to want to keep it, so I'll throw it out. Yeah, you can go. Or light, unless you're over a hundred point, I'm not feeling it. Action drum goes down a little, the rest of it goes up. It's just stamina. A hundred more armor, so we'll go ahead and do that. We could color all the thing I'm doing now. You are ornament. I was wearing ornament stuff. Not to where I care. Uh, we'll keep it and see what it sells for, because it's one inch. Oh, and I suppose you don't sell very well. I'm not in there. I'm on the ground. Put that on the ground. Everything claimed by the desert. Oh, I have a uh A 
nothing new I can use in here, right? Not, uh, let's see what my orc seals have. I have something here. Use your weapon spell damage to 127. Sure. Wolf nothing there. Heavy armor. How much that can cost? Okay. Uses magic and stamina. Your heavy attacks restore by 4% for each armor worn. I don't know if that works well on a werewolf though. I no longer have it. Okay, Talia. Let's you have go now witnessed the first sacrifice, and you know the true honor need not be named. You are now one. Yes. There is little we can do to help our fellow Ashaba here now. So we should do as my father wished. We should dedicate ourselves to destroying the Withered Hand. They killed my father. I will enjoy the opportunity to even the score. Where should we start? There is a place to the northeast, a sacred place called Tuwaka's Throne. It is a place of quiet and of honor. Many, many heroes have been laid to rest there. I worry what would happen if the Withered Hand were to go there. Let's go there first. I must see to the consecration of my father's remains. It would be disrespectful to do otherwise. Go on to Tuwaka's Throne. Look for an Ashaba named Ramati. I know these sands well. I will catch up with you soon enough. Okay. Let me see what your helmet does for us. What is your partner here say? Welcome to the tribe, sister. The wisdom of the chief was deep as a well. I know his faith in you was deserved. Okay, then. How about you, mister? It is our duty as a Shaba to assist the king if he calls upon us. I only wish he had called on us earlier. Perhaps this terrible poisoning could have been avoided. Hmm. Maybe. Midori. Down in spell resistant, but up in health. Spell resistant drops 100? Less than 100. Health jumps in thousands, so yes. Got a red guard helmet on. It's almost my color, or is it just the light? Can't tell. Also ornament. Sell for more than a hundred more than it's worth and I'm ready to get rid of it. Hung licking? Tongue looking walk. Or, or are you licking tongues? Or are you licking tongue? Does I have skills? What is there? I have skills. What? Oh, I could have transformed werewolf transformation? I don't understand. Understand what the uh, is that what it was yelling at me about? It was. I don't understand what it was about, but okay. How far north am I going? Could follow this, which seems like a safer path. What the hell is this? Oh, I need to do that first. Okay, we have enough play to do like one more mission. There's this mission over here that guy ran into. Baby, what are you wearing? <laughs> the towel.
Okay, I'm back. Damn it. The wrong button again. Kill some elves. A dark elf. No, oh, not a dark elf. Uh, hello. Mm -hmm. I was just tidying up. This was our camp before the elves came. Well, it was Lady Laurent's camp. Oh, I shouldn't say our anymore. Oh, goodness. What will I do? She fired me. Why did she fire you? Because it's all my fault. The Aldmeri. Lady Laurent sent me through the portal to investigate. When the elves saw me, I ran and led them to the portal. So now she hates me. Please, I beg you, will you help me get back in her good graces? Sure, but how? Praise you, praise you. I'm trying to gather all her things, but her tools are scattered out in the ruins, and those are her most important possessions. If you'll get the tools for me, I just know she'll forgive me. I just know it. Sure, whatever. There's one more thing you should know. Lady Laurent hired this thuggish Tamian fellow, and I believe she already asked him to recover her tools. You should speak to him up on the ramparts. Tell him we have it taken care of. Why not just let Tamian get the tools? Because he's a brute, and I need to be the one to give her the tools. If I can't make her forgive me, she'll just leave me here, and then what will I do? This is my only chance. Hang out with the Alva here, they're pretty chill. Some. Anybody want some? Oh, how the flip cheat up there? I respect the radiance of Magnus. I simply wish it was not so fiercely upon me. How do you get up here? Wow, I found a way up here. How were you meant to get up here in the first place? It isn't my old friend from Crosswitch. Oh. Let me guess. Lady Laurent has you helping clean up this mess she made. Or is it Stibbins, the bootless coward? He's hoping Lady Laurent will forgive him. Good to see you again. How's the mercenary business been? It could be worse. Lady Laurent pays well, and she's got a pretty ambitious travel schedule. So I'm getting to see places I had never dreamed of. Can't say this desert's one of the highlights, though. Stibbins asked me to recover her tools. Did he? I'm surprised he could get that out through the whimpering and whining. Lady Laurent already has someone to recover her tools. And you would recover them and give Stibbins the credit? Does that mean you're getting the tools? Just following orders. Even before this, Stibbins couldn't keep up, so Lady Laurent hired me. I was just getting a bird's eye view before getting to work. Say, though, if 
you were going to save Stibbins the trouble, why not help me instead? Why would I do that? Well, for one thing, I'm better looking. For another, I'm actually getting paid. Stibbins was always just a glorified slave. Help me get the tools and I'll cut you in. I have to think about it. Don't think too long. I'll go down there and get the tools myself if I have to. They're in backpacks, by the way. I bet Stibbins didn't even tell you that. Have you collected any? I was wondering if you were going to ask that. Yeah, I snatched up a few tool bags earlier. But there's no reason for me to give them to you, is there? What the flip are you supposed to get up here normally? Wow, you're slow, man. Hello guys. Apparently I'm eating this one that's already up. Game up, thrown away. No what are you doing here? I'll go to the givens. Well, I think I've gathered up all of Lady Durant's personal well, things. From the camp. The I just need those tools from out in the ruins. I don't I guess. suppose you beat Tamian to them, did you? It's most of the tools right here. Praise the eight. You just saved my reputation and my livelihood. Can I have the tools then? Yes. Ha! That sneaky Tamian fellow sure will be surprised. Hopefully now Lady Laurent will forgive me and realize we don't need any hired help. A mercenary. What an oblivion was she thinking? I don't mind. I don't think she'll uh, fire oh, 
You are like a bottle of iced colliquiva in this dreary desert. Hopefully this will restore Lady Laurent's confidence in me. I still can't understand. How could she doubt me after so many years' service? I think she was mostly just frustrated. But while I was rooting around, I definitely saw a I see it. That's not it. Oh, there it is. All those who march under the Eagle Banner represent the glorious family. Okay, like their rules. Who knew the desert would be so empty? Freaking desert, what do you expect? I did. I guess I did. I heard the you were spotted noise. That's weird. Up here, dude. But okay. Whatever. Okay, last one.
sword. I'm eating my own dog, I'm not sure which one. <laughs> Is now where I'm supposed to go? Oh, that's the portal chamber. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, this is where I'm supposed to go. Yes, I round out with this. Confused me. Ah. guy who talked to me. You certainly made short work of those elves. There seem to be few odd skeletons down here. No problem for you, I'm sure. Now, I assume you found the old tome in my camp? Yes, here's the book. Thank you very much. Fortunately, I can translate the ancient Iliad, and that should tell us how to close the portal. Where's the portal? It's through this door right behind me. The problem is that it's locked, but it appears that it's controlled by a switch deeper in the ruins. Would you be a dear and find the switch? Sure. Oh, if only I could have someone like you around full time. If you'll get the switch, that will give me time to study up whatever words I need to speak to close the portal. Once you get it opened, I'll just go on in. So meet me in the portal room. Okay.
Open chest, plus for me. Alien room, very familiar. Before you speak, stranger, know this for centuries a spell has bound me. Many have tried to free me and failed. This prison has no lock or bonds to break. I can try to free you. Did you hear me? This is no common spell. It was cast by Ultima wizards long since dead. This is a true curse. The task is beyond you. Of course, a fool would still try. Do as you wish. I won't harbor faint hope. I'll see you, freed. For centuries, amateurs like yourself have tried to release me. Fools, all of you. You'd have a better chance of becoming the next emperor. How did you end up here? It pains me to speak of the past. Would you force me to relive such bitter memories? No. Fine. What would you ask of me? Why are there so many dead down here? It was the regatta, the warrior wave. The warriors sought vengeance. The swords of Yakuda passed through these halls, and the High Elves were washed away. You survived. They would have killed me, were it not for this spell. Instead, I watched, safely ensconced within this prison, as my captors were slaughtered. Many centuries passed before I learned who the warriors were, or from whence they came. What did you learn? A foreign people had arrived on these shores. They came from a distant land, Yakuda it was called. Yakudan warriors set out to conquer the new world they found. Singers named them the Regatta. Um, do you have any idea how the spell works? If I knew, don't you think I would have escaped by now? All I know is the tiles must be used in the right order, and the order was determined by time, whatever that means. Oh my god, what? Are they all the constellations? Warrior, Lady. Okay, so the furnace starts here. So let's start with the furnace and see what happens. Apprentice, where are you? Or. Seem okay. Okay, so that was not right. Uh, Oh, 
I'm gonna look up the order of the seasons. This is probably an order of the seasons crap, and I don't know the order of the seasons, so hold on. But that's what I did. Oh. Maybe the lovers first. Let's see if I can do this. Okay then. From the ritual to the thief, they watch him. There is no escape. Uh, wasn't the lover, huh? I'm an idiot, I didn't see that. Okay, so the ritual is first, then a lover, so we're looking for an eye. Eye for an eye. This should work. And then the lover. The lover was next, right? Lover, and she was over here. So I poked him in the eye. Touch his lever. After that is the Lord. Talk to the Lord. I uh, didn't expect that to work. Oh. This is the puzzle people couldn't figure out for centuries. Then the mage. After talking to the Lord, we go talk to the mage. Who is the real smarts of the kingdom. After the mage, we go to the shadow. We become thieves. Yes, fuck everybody else is how you really make money. This is assassin, I don't know. We are but shadows. And after the shadow, there is the steed, because we have to get away on horseback. How are you doing that? With my not too large brains, Bilak. Then we have the apprentice. The person who helps the mage. Mage will no longer talk to us because we became thieves, but this apprentice will help. And then he makes us do strong magistical warriors. I don't know what I'm talking about right now. I'm just trying to get this shit done. After the warriors, we take a lady. You may be onto something. You think?
Oh shit. After the lady, it's the tower. Get the lady to the tower. I don't know, to hide her up there? And after the tower, we do the Atronach. The Atronach's attack. The destruction of the tower by the astronaut. Lastly, he becomes the thief. To head back to the old leaper. Question that mattered. And should be least Hello, really old orc. By the bloody fangs of Moloch, by the stench of Moloch's gaping maw, what have you done? How can this be? I'm free. Yep, free to leave the place. I... I should thank you, but I don't even think this is what I wanted. It's been so long since my life was my own. This is all I know. I don't want to leave. Well, you have a problem with the fact that you are now no longer kept in a mortal cell. So you can leave, or you can stay here and die. The orc I know and love would never utter such words. Nura, is it really you? It's been so long. We've suffered enough of this curse. By the grace of Mara, I have been allowed to take you beyond this mortal realm. Finally, a release from the suffering of this world. Ah, oh, you're just gonna go off Come, and die? My love. We have the rest of eternity to be together. Also, is she an alien? Well, okay then. I think I got distracted by whatever the hell that was about. Yeah, I'm already the minion. I saw her even doing the thing to the other side of
do that, but okay. They have so much faith in that seal they put on the main door. They don't even have anyone guarding the portal. I'm not complaining, though. Are you ready to do this? Let's do it. All right. You're going to have to protect me, though. The chamber may be clear now, but as soon as I start the ritual, they'll realize it on the other side. They might try to charge through and stop us. You know, werewolf. All right. Let's get this started. <clears throat> Pro -roso. Woohoo! Take that, you damned elves! Oh, wait, I just lost my place. That takes care of that now, doesn't it? I'm actually quite relieved. It would have been so embarrassing to have been responsible for the fall of Alakir. After I opened the portal, I considered just leaving and denying that I was ever here. I'm glad you stayed to close it. I am too. Now. If you would, though, I still would prefer to keep this quiet. I do have a reputation to uphold, you know. Oh, frick. Hold on, I have shit. In my pockets, I need to get rid of the sharp head. Oh, no, thank you. So, gotta look inside. Oh, that was my old one, wasn't it? Oh, no, thank you. I have little. How much does it help? Oh, I have a thousand. Stamina really needs to be hit though. That's really my weak point. Definitely no. And no. What did you get here? Well, that takes. I am too. Let me find stuff, right? Oh, oh she just gave me. Oh, she gave me. Oh, there we are. Up on health, down on magic of recovery. I don't even use magic, though. I mean, magic of recovery is just a little. Stamina and health goes up a lot, though. Of a bunch of more high elf. A little different, but not by much. I do need to recolor it. Penetrable. Okay. Reduces much value one point. Oh, cost one. Reduces your damage taken, grants you and your group a minor courage, and summons two dire wolves to fight by your side. Augments your light attacks to gain a bleed, and your heavy attacks to do damage in a cone in front of you. I can either get a pack with me, or uh, become stronger. Lead a 
would be a really helpful. This also increases my stamina, which is a big issue. There's some less status, so that makes me stronger in defense. Yeah, we'll do pack leader. Looks like I can do other, some other stuff too. I can get producing hell now. I really get the strength. Okay, I've chosen to become pack leader. Quick, I get out of here. Oh, we're here. Are the elves gone? Or are they still around? The elves are still around, huh? Yeah! Oh, that's the white werewolf. Yes. That works for Jason. <laughs> Let's just play around as a werewolf, shall we? Surrounded by dogs. Oh. behind you too.
I don't know how good this good level throughout the game, but holy cow. I was already not taking enough damage. I don't care about your grandeur. Let's see how long we can keep the werewolf going. We're running out of things to kill, though. Oh, frick. Okay, let's go pay off my $100 bounty. This person over here. I know there's a freaking guard right here. I feel I'm. Let me help you clear your conscience. Pay off your bounty, and you're free to go. Perfect. Stay out of trouble now. Yeah, you only saw me as a werewolf. Holy cow. <laughs> what time are we at? We're at 3:30, exactly where I want us. Okay, so that'll be the end of our gameplay. That was a nice little werewolf section there at the end. I didn't give away all of my codes. I hope the ones that got them like them. I hope they all are. Like my story, if y'all do, please share it with your friends and stuff like that. People who actually buy my book and share it will support me very... Will support me a lot. Will help me out. Um, I, I will continue to write forever, but the more I get from writing the more I can afford to write some more. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much all i got to say on that. <laughs> I really love writing. It's my passion. It's my calling. I hope I'm great at it, but that's up to y'all to decide. Um, where am I in this thing? I'm assuming there's nothing here I can do. I'm supposed to be going to... supposed to go this way next time we play this character. If we play ESO again, I don't know if we'll be directly into a werewolf character. I am having a lot of fun with her. Or if we'll be doing the other characters because we're getting kind of ahead of ourselves here. But I don't know. It'll be what I rush it like. Uh, next time we play it will probably be Fortnite. Um, again, uh, y'all can find my book, Bite of the Moon by Joshua Winters, on any ebook store. It's a little hard to find on Google Play for some reason. You can head, I mean, you can click the link in the chat right now. Or you can head to, uh, if you don't see the link in the chat at the beginning, I posted it at the very beginning. I can still see it, but I don't know how that works on the VODs, actually. Um, or if you're on YouTube, I will probably post it in the descriptor. It would really help me a lot, and instead of just throwing money at my uh, streams or my YouTube, you'll be throwing money at something I'll work hard to make. And, uh... I'll appreciate it. It's a werewolf novel, so if you like werewolves, which is what this, these two episodes today were about, uh, you should like it. 
Um, I hope you like it. I guess I'll see y'all later. Let me check out my schedule. You won't see me for the rest of this week, most likely. Ooh, got hot in my room. Yeah, the rest of this week I'll be busy. Um, you'll likely see me again Monday and Wednesday. Those will be my two days of streams this week. Uh, that will be, keep or take any changes like this week where I had to change Monday with Tuesday for somebody. I had Monday off. So right now, we'll plan on me having Monday and Wednesday streams go in. Um, and do expect the next one probably to be Fortnite. If anything, we'll have the weeklies up. There don't have any stories, which I'm a little weirded out about. It's been kind of storyless, unless you count Bite as a story missions. I guess we could count her story missions, because we found out she's part of the nothing. Oh, and uh, this isn't this is Fortnite related, so I don't know how much it means to this stream. But for you Fortnite watchers, I, something I missed, at the end of Bite we were called the hero or the warrior of the last reality which means that nothing is someone from the last reality we don't know we know that when they went to go get Gino someone who looked like the rea last reality was on the other side of that portal they you know fighting Gino in the comics but we still don't know who that was that we saw unless they was just a hidden Gino from us same thing being uh you don't know if the last reality is the same species as um I'm sorry, we don't know if the nothing, which is a person apparently, and has something to do with this chrome, is the same species as the cube queen, and origin, and apparently the herald, which looks a lot like them, or if it's a different species. I'm going to assume it's similar species. And if the nothing is bothering us, and the nothing is part of the last reality, most likely this is our last season of Fortnite Chapter 3. I didn't feel weird that we finished it off so early. I feel like it's too early. We haven't been on this map long enough for me to feel something for it when we lose it. Whatever floats their boat, I guess. Maybe they're just going to keep shortening everything and we have like one chapter left or something. Who knows what's going to happen. I always wish that things like Fortnite will never quit, but I guess everything comes to an end and I'll have to have a fun new main. This will be my new main. If this lasts for a while. What do you think, Squeaky? Squeaky says, I am but tej yet by my wares. Do whatever makes you happy. Would you like some skooma? <laughs> I hope you all have a good evening and a good week. I'll see you on Monday. Good weekend. I'll see you on Monday. Um, peace and out. And please check out my book if you all have the chance. See you all later, guys.